They'll be calling you radical, so I'm gonna break this news. I just got the call, had to pull over. This is a big, big story. So giant story, as I predicted, I predicted they're gonna emergency close the entire Pacific. It's gonna happen. Now, I told you they were gonna make something up. They were gonna make a story up, and Trump's right, CNN is fake news, and I'll prove it. I can prove the fake news, and so this is big news. Emergency clothes are coming on the entire Pacific Ocean. They're saying it's a fucking deadly tapeworm in the wild-caught Pacific fucking salmon. Now look, the salmon are coming in scrawny, as I've been reporting. They're coming in white. Total epic collapse. They were not about to blame this on Fukushima. They're fake light tests on season 137 and 134. Season 134 and 137 to test in the flesh of a salmon is nearly impossible, nearly impossible. So they won't give you the trinium levels, which is very possible. They won't do it. So this is a big, big story. So deadly tape, Japanese, Japanese tapeworm. And I'll tell you, I can prove the lies of Obama. National Geographic, which is House of Windsor, Rupert Murdoch, CNN Operation Foxconn, he bought National Geographic. They're putting out this picture of Barack Obama snorkeling in the reserve. Know this, the reserve where the humpbacks come, I practice my backward watch for the Austrian inauguration. So in the Federal Reserve, excuse me, there's a Freudian slip, slip. Operation Foxconn, Rupert Murdoch, they fucking buy it, snorkeling, so the federal, the federal protected new garden, which is not a garden, it's all dead, it's all dead, the humpbacks, this is the time of year the humpbacks. By the way, this should be plump full of bald eagles, plump full. So no one will keep track of the bald eagles, so people are paid to do it. The guy who's the head of the fucking DOE right here, or excuse me, the Utah Natural East is good, get rid of those scavengers. That's what he told me. These fuckers are haters, they're scumbags. You know, the marine biologists need to all rot in hell and die. I hope Obama gets cancer in his fucking brain so bad. Remember Barack Obama's mother died of cancer. This is the good rat puppet bitch, John Holdren's bitch on a leash. And if you don't know who John Holdren is, you don't know nothing about this. John Holdren's bitch on a leash, his eugenics bitch on a leash, Barack Barry Obama. And it's like everybody's bitching about Trump and his illegal activity, it's like I told somebody this morning, one of the hippie friends. You know, these radical fucking far right fucking winger fucking lunatics. It's like I told him. Who's gonna stop him? Who is going to stop Barack Obama? Who's gonna stop him? The pussy Democrats? The biggest pussies who ever lived. Don't raise your voice, you lose the argument. The fucking Democrats fuck themselves. They're like Ted Nugent, a pussy. Oh, I wanna kill a fucking pussies. Cowards, America, home of the cowards. This is a major fucking story. These lying fucking rats. I told you it was gonna happen. I told you, I told you, they're gonna fucking have to blame this on something else. Epic fucking collapse. Epic fucking collapse in the Pacific Ocean. The wells are all dying. This is the greatest ecological catastrophe in human history, post Fukushima, the Great Pacific Genocide. I want to say one other thing. The Yucca Mountain story. So, this fucking rat, Ernest Moxie Fuel, MIT Department of Energy rat, who was at Fukushima, Japan. I was in front of the White House fucking on November 6th, 2013. Fuck, when they called the fucking TEPCO fucking executives in, I have videos of it. He secretly went over there. Ernest Moxie fool, MIT rat from hell, says, oh no, they're not going to fucking Yucca Mountain. I got news. The only thing going to Yucca Mountain is Ernest Moxie fuel. You know why? The Department of Energy, when I'm done with these fucking rats, I'll tell you why. There's a federal penitentiary out there. And that's where he's going. These arrogant fuckers at MIT think they're still running the show. So Rick Perry, I want people to know, why was Rick Perry named the fucking head of the DOE? Because Rick Perry ha is, he's fucking, he, talk about corruption. He owns part of the Energy Solutions fucking cabal. They're going to 
Rick Perry wants to put all the nuclear waste in the hole in Texas. He's part of that fucking group. Good. Good. You fucking Texans, wake the fuck up. Wake the fuck up. And here's more breaking news. I'm going to break it right now. Nobody has this. Nobody. I, you don't think I'm connected? Oh, am I connected? So the waste from San Lombre, San Lombre never closed without me. The only people that get anything, the rest of this country's got their head up their ass, is California. You people in Nevada that don't want this fucking nuclear waste, a congressional act at Yucca Mountain, you better start attacking fucking Illinois. Illinois, fucking, and Cuomo, the bank bail, especially in Illinois, their fucking governments bailed them out, and they said they're dumping it on you. They're in Illinois, the state taxpayer says they fucking have that. This is breaking news. The San Onofre waste is already fucking starting to lose, leave the tarmac, they're ahead of schedule. It's going to whip in New Mexico. Right now, today as we speak, it's fucking secret hush, 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 but they got a temporary permit, so it's not going on the fucking beach. That's where it's going. And Rick Perry's all gung-ho for it. Rick Perry is, mark my words, Rick Perry's in on this up to his fucking eyeballs. Corruption? Oh, come on. That's what this fucking something rotten in the new Denmark? And like I said, corruption, Obama administration? Fuck, eugenics, eugenics, eugenics. Softball pussies. Their Justice Department did nothing. Barack Obama is nothing but John Holdren's Fukushima cover-up eugenics bitch on a leash. A two-bit fucking loser little bitch. And the Democrats are pussies. Pussies. And the Republicans are fucking ignorant, drunk on ignorance and proud of it. They think they're above the fucking law. Well, apparently they are. Who the fuck is going to stop them? I want you to ask, who's going to stop them? These are major fucking stories. Major stories. Major, major, major. CDC. Ha! I knew they were going to make up a fucking lie. The Great Pacific Genocide, the greatest PhD in human history, done told by a guy full of AMLU fucking chemia, fucking grassrooters. Fuck, wow, what a story. Stand tuned.